Home court proved to be an advantage this season for the Lakeland Rustlers men's basketball team. Peter Sambu's squad finished the 2010-2011 season undefeated at home. As Aaron Shrek reports, the Rustlers head coach and interim Edmonton Energy bench boss is hoping to have the same support and outcome this Saturday when the IBL makes an appearance in Lakeland College. This court has been empty since the Rustlers advanced to the ACAC Final Four back in February. But the rims will be rattling this weekend. The Edmonton Energy are in town. It's fun. You know, you, when you come here, you have to adjust your eyes and adjust your mind to the different type of speed. But once, once it gets into it, high scoring games and high octane basketball. That's exciting. I mean, for us, it's a little bit of a fundraiser, but also a chance to expose, you know, the Lloyd Minster community and surrounding area to, uh, to the professional game. Uh, you know, they've been pretty lucky to see what we've been able to put on the court, especially with our, our men's team in the last couple of years, and this is a whole new level. Sam Boo started the season with the energy as the assistant, but when the head coach stepped down, he stepped up. It gives me a chance to work on my coaching skills throughout the summer, which a lot of uh, college coaches don't have a chance to do because most of the time we're recruiting, but it's good to have a game here. I think he'll learn a lot for, from it. Uh, you know, he talked about the high pace of the IBL game. I know my fear is that he'll forget to coach defense when he comes back here because their scores are often well into the hundreds. Uh, the Rustlers head coach has had a remarkable amount of success on his home floor, and he says that's not going to change. We don't lose in this gym, and I've been telling those guys all through practice last couple of weeks, I said, hey, we can't afford to lose at, at Lakeland because we don't do that. These bleachers were full all season for the Lakeland Rustlers men's basketball team, and Peter Sambu is hoping to have the same result this Saturday. Overwhelming and humbling, but uh, yeah, it would be nice. It's just a matter of us winning here. That's the most important thing. Uh, that's our approach to this weekend. The Energy and Portland Chinooks tip off at 7.30 Saturday night. Aaron Streck. New Cap Sports. Now in local baseball action, the Lloydminster Twins improved their record to a perfect 3-0 with an 11-1 win over the North Battleford Beavers last night. They are now three wins into what could be a three-peat season for the local ball club. The Twins are back in action tonight as they visit the Lakers. The Lloyd Midgets get to host the Flyers at the Legion Ballpark. The Reds are in Unity and the Jays visit Wilkie. All right, that is all the time I have to talk sports tonight.